Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel once again and here we go. Today I'm making you guys an amazing vegetable stock as you can see already. So, the question is, how did I do that? Well, this one to find out. You need to follow me step by step. First and foremost, I want to show you everything that I'll be using for the vegetable stock. So I have some carrots in there, some mushrooms, I have celery, I have onions here, I have a bit of uh, uh, garlic in here, I'm going to put, it, uh, put in a tomato as well and also leeks and of course with that I'll be putting in some kind of herb. First things first, we need to cut the vegetables. You don't have to peel this if you don't want to, but you can if you'd like to. So I'll just roughly give them a quick peel. Actually, all this is fine, so I'm gonna put all that stuff in as well. So I'll give this a quick rough chop. And all this stuff right here, all you have to do is just wash it. That's about it, and you can just put everything in. A leek soup so I'll keep that and I'll use this for the stock. You don't really have to put this in but I felt like I'm going to put in some tomatoes that you have some leftover tomatoes there that I'll be throwing in. Alright so as you, as you can see our celery, our leeks, our carrots plus all the scraps right here, our onions, uh, you have the, the mushrooms and of course our garlic. I'm gonna put everything into the pot right now. Everything go in. Now you can put in all your herbs, a bit of that, this is actually from our garden, it's actually a basil and parsley and stuff like that, but you know what, why not, because it will give flavors anyway, so, I'm putting some peppercorns, okay. our cloves, putting some rosemary, put some thyme in here, and there we go, well at this point, you don't even need to keep an eye on it go relax I don't know take a walk read a book or whatever and give it maybe give and take um, an hour and a half should, should be okay but if you want to give it like two three hours much better and for our word of the day today how do we call an orange well this is a mandarin orange but how do we call generally an orange in my country we call it <laughs> sorry I'm so excited back there we call that omuchungwa omuchungwa is an orange in Uganda. So our vegetable stock, as you can see, it's going on just fine. At this point, I made sure my heat is low, so it can actually just continue uh, working slowly. It's only been about 30 minutes now. I'll just leave it on for about uh, an hour and a half or two. Several hours later, look at that. Now it's time to strain it. So you need to strain this out. Can't wait, we're going to use this chicken stock for soups, in our rice, making sauces. That's all garbage. This really reminds me of a consomme when we were actually in school because it's the clearest broth soup ever. Now, let's say you're not a fan of eating soup smash. If I were you, it's what I do. Put in some black pepper maybe, if you like, a touch of salt, da da da, and try it. It's actually pretty good by itself. I mean, imagine all those goodies in here. If you're, again, if you're vegetarian, a vegan or whatever, you can use this recipe right here and actually for your own benefit and make some amazing soups or maybe some amazing meals, whatever you want to use it for. Alrighty, 
So thank you for coming guys. Give me that thumbs up, give me that like, share, subscribe and uh, check out another next video that you'll be seeing at the end of this or the ones in the link. Bye now.